this lesson from like law school and law school exams in general it's one big stress test So, just finished my first final. Um, it was very hard, um, and I won't know my results until January. Um, so, yeah, so that's first exam down, two more to go. Beautiful Saturday night. Gotta love it. Well, gotta work hard and play harder okay guys so it's 7 a.m i'm getting ready to go ice skating but guys like tomorrow is my second final towards i feel i feel nervous about it um but i don't know i'm honestly i'm just ready to be done like I felt like like I've been studying like hardcore every single day so I'm like okay today I'm gonna not take the day but I'm gonna take a half the day spend it with my friends and just ice skate and just have fun and enjoy a little bit because I'm close to the finish line and I have to keep reminding myself that like okay you'll down me like you're almost there like as you guys saw um, my civil procedure exam my first test I'm glad that I got my hard, like the hard exam out the way, like cool, like I'm glad about that. But nonetheless, like, gosh, guys, like that final to me, like was pretty hard. Um, I actually had dinner with my mentor the day after and he was like, you know, you're gonna, you're gonna be like, you're gonna feel like shit after every single final. Like it's just natural, it's how you're gonna feel. But imagine you're wearing like this and imagine you get your grades back and you actually did better than you thought. I'm like, well, wow, that would be a great twist of events, but I'm hoping for the best. Like, honestly, I, after the exam, like, yeah, like I felt bad, um, but there's nothing I can do about it. Like, I'm not, I'm not gonna ponder and wonder what coulda, shoulda, woulda. I just, I'm just gonna trust my preparation and my process. I did what I had to do to the best of my ability so honestly I came to terms the day after I'm just gonna leave it to God's hands and whatever will be will be obviously like I want to do great but hey I did the best I can now I just have uh, my torts and my contract exam left and I'm so excited to just get it over with so I have torts tomorrow um, or this week and then I have uh, contracts three days after and then I'm done guys like I'm so ready to be done <laughs> I gotta say though like law school exams are more different than any exam that I've ever taken for sure like I've never to know like the high stakes like of this these exams that you take just like your whole grade depends on this one test is pretty nerve-wracking i won't lie but one of the biggest the best advice that my mentor actually gave me this week um when i had dinner with him he said you know you were you're you're smart you know you were capable enough to get here to get to law school which is a big accomplishment in and itself and then on top of that you're not going to become dumb overnight and i was like for some reason that hit me i was like whoa you know he's like as i know the biggest thing that a lot of like law school students feel is you know imposter syndrome and everything he's actually he's a lawyer himself um he works in-house for a federal bank um, and he was telling me, you know, when I was in college, there were some subjects that I excelled in and some that I didn't. And it sucks. And he's like, yeah, and I'm like, you know, I'm old enough and I still haven't gone over it. But it's just the way the cookie crumbles. It is what it is. Um, but he also told me that the biggest, like, think about, like, he's like, think about it. You know, not all students make it up to this point. And then it's like... In the beginning, for example, like I had a couple people in my law school class that dropped out and then I thought about it more and I'm like, whoa, like that actually makes sense. It's like constantly like we're under like a big amount of stress all the time and 
it's true it's like if you don't know how to handle stress it's like not the environment um so it's definitely made me a little bit a little bit i'm still working on it more manageable um with like my feelings and how i feel and my stress but that's the biggest thing i learned this week the biggest advice ever given to me was law school is a whole big stress test and i was like wow like for some reason that hit me in such a way i'm like i never thought about it that way um but yeah guys so my progress with my test one out of three i'm so excited to just get it over with and yeah you know if any of you guys are thinking uh, about also like coming into law school just remember that when you're in this like is a big stress test will it make you feel better all the time no but is it a big lesson that I learned heck yeah like now I feel like approaching everything I'm just like okay remember there's they're trying to weed you out like that is the whole purpose like they're trying to weed you out like they're trying to make you strong because out there in the real world when you're an attorney like you're gonna be like in constant stress all the time the stress of your client the stress of the judge depending on what kind of lawyer you are um it's just constant stress all the time from all angles so yeah so now i'm gonna go my my best friends and i have this tradition we go to Bryan park every year I'm looking forward to it i can't believe that i'm even like honestly ice skating at like 9 a.m that's crazy but what a great way to relax before final like your well my next final so i'll see you guys there